Well, it is primary day in Virginia, and today Republican and Democratic okay. voters will pick their nominees for the general election in November, but voter turnout is expected to be low. So 13 News Now reporter Megan Shin is live in Windsor Woods to tell us why. Megan. Ashley, yesterday political analysts told us that they expect few people to actually show up to cast a ballot at places like we're at, where Windsor Woods Elementary School has a polling station for people to show up, even though it is important this time of year with the races in our community. Now in Hampton Roads, 14 candidates are contesting four seats in the state primary election. They're all competing in six races to represent people living on the south side and peninsula between municipal, state, and federal elections. Plus primaries and special elections. Hampton Roads residents can vote five times in one year depending on where you live. Well, 13 News Now political analyst Quentin Kidd says this explains a potential lower voter turnout today. In all fairness to uh, Virginians, um, we are asked to vote in Virginia far more than most people are asked to vote in most states. up to five times in some areas, as he said. And coming up on 13 News Now at noon, we'll be sticking around and bring you a broadcast with interviews of people showing up here to vote. Live in Virginia Beach, Megan Shin, 13 News Now.